Does Scotland have a constitution? Well, not one of its own. So there is a constitutional underpinning to the powers of the Scottish Parliament and the powers and responsibilities of the Scottish Government. And that lies in a piece of Westminster legislation, legislation passed in the UK Parliament. And it's called the Scotland Act. The Scotland Act 1998 was the original um, piece of legislation that led to the creation of the Scottish Parliament. And it's been revised a few times uh, since then in 2012 and then in 2016. These were the major revisions to the powers and the responsibilities of the Scottish Parliament and the Scottish Government, uh, but at various points uh, in between there as well in less significant ways. And it was the Secretary of State for Wales at the time of devolution that talked about devolution as a process and not an event. And he was referring in particular uh, to Wales, where there has been lots of constitutional change to the powers of the Welsh uh, devolved institutions. But the same can be applied to Scotland too. So the powers and the responsibilities, that constitutional underpinning um, of the devolved institutions has evolved. And it's evolved in light of experience, it's evolved in light of politics, and it's evolved in light of demand.